Hey everybody, welcome to Daily Entomologist. Today, out looking for more dragonflies and damselflies. Um, today, I actually have my friend Nick with me. He's never been out collecting before, so taking him out. And in the net, I already have the second species of the day. I already caught another species of damselfly that I didn't have yet. And this one is actually a dragonfly that I've actually never seen before. So I'm not trying. All right, and there you have it. Very cool looking. I'm not entirely sure what it is, but I'll find out later. You can see the beautiful amber coloration at the front half with the wings there. Kind of greenish yellow color mostly, and then a yellow and whitish blue underside right there. Definitely really cool looking species. Alright, I'm gonna get this one settled away and see what else we can find. Alright, well, I managed to snag a black saddle bait right out of the air. I kind of wish I caught it in camera because it was pretty awesome. But I'm gonna get them out and show you guys. And there we go. As you see, it's a pretty large, stocky dragonfly. Yeah. And I showed you this in a video a couple of videos ago. I saw a nice close up one I got you, but you can see the black on the hind wing there. But, uh, excellent catch, and the third different species today so far, and I've been here for about 15 minutes. Um, so, yeah. Let's see what else we can catch. Look at that, Eric, four for four. Yeah, this one was kind of nice because he, he liked his little perch right over there and kept coming back to it. Ooh. New guy or? Uh, it is a new one. Is that coming in decent? I think so. Yeah. I think it uh, I think this one might be a variegated meadowhawk actually. So I'm maybe. Looks like it. But uh yeah. So far it's been an excellent day. And uh hopefully we'll get some keep doing some more uh, action shots, huh? Oh yeah. Yeah. It wasn't like that one before though. You good? Um, yep. Uh, so, standing right here we already saw like four different species. Something like that. There's this flash saddle bait there. We scooped up a green darner right up over here and landed over here. So, here's hopefully for a of power.
green donors recently emerged. Really? Yeah. So I don't really want to catch them right now because he's still drying out. Let's see if you can get him on camera. He's right there. Or she. Can you see how bright that green is? Why can't I see it? Oh, there it is. The super bright green right there. Mm -hmm. That's still wet and just kind of patched, so it's still drying, so. All right, you guys, next turn, there's a black saddle beds that just kind of flew off. that we just kind of lost. He didn't fly away, he flew up. Oh, oh, he's... All right, he just landed. Oh, yeah, sneak up behind him and try and get, keep the net low. You can see it right there. A bee bothered it and it flew off. All right. Well, he just won't sit still very long, will he? Oh! <laughs> I almost had him. <laughs> <laughs> I saw him coming back. I should have waited like one more second. Insect collecting, you don't hit it every time. But there's definitely a couple more species hanging around right in here, so we're going to keep looking. Well, we got a damsel fly that just happened to land literally right here in front of me. Uh, I think that's uh, yet another different species I do not have. So there's another one flying around. But, uh, Kind of really pretty, nice blue on it. So here goes nothing, huh? Yeah, got it. So I'm gonna get that in a envelope and continue hunting. All right, well I just caught one in the net, and there's a. One sitting on the brush right over there. That just flew off. We're still trying to get a dragonfly for Nick. Yeah. Now it's just teasing you. Well, that's going down. I'm going to take this one out and see what we got. Just kind of tipped over. Ooh. Ooh. Beautiful right there. Another meadow hawk. Nice male. Gorgeous colors.
Awesome. The good day has been continuing on. Honestly, I don't think I've missed a... Uh, you haven't? I haven't, I haven't missed one yet. You haven't. All right, let's continue on our way. All right, so we moved on from our hot spot. Let's see what else we can find. And we got a willow skimmer. Right there. Well, Nick, do you want to try for it? Or do you want me? What's good angle? Where you are? Uh, where I am would have been a good angle if it went to phone away. And now it's high up in the tree. Oh, well, yeah. Think it's coming back? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, it's been an excellent day so far, so. You got a different dragonfly. Cool. <laughs> Let's see what it is. First glance, it looks like a female meadow hawk. It is a meadow hawk. That's actually your first dragonfly. We were catching damselflies all morning, but this is the first dragonfly. Is it a female? I think it is, yeah. And female metal hawks are pain to ID too. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna, huh? Yeah. Oh. Is it back? Yeah, I'm gonna let this one go. I'm not comfortable with the females, but yeah. Where are you seeing this guy? Right there. Black spot? A black spot right on the side of that tree. Keep the net low. And you have to be really fast when you get close. <laughs> I barely missed him. Honestly, I need some hiking shoes because I almost rolled my ankle doing that. Well, as you guys can see, and like I said earlier in the video, we don't catch them all. This comes with the territory. But hopefully we can find another one or find it again. I think there's a species of it's a species of snake tail dragon. Right
got him. Yes. Oh, thank you. I believe it is. Gorgeous green and yellows right there. Awesome. You can see the slightly swollen end of the abdomen too. Excellent catch right there. We're really racking up the different species today. Yeah, pretty soon you're not gonna have anything to do. All right, so Nick got to take off, so I'm collecting by myself now. And right over here, we got a male widow skimmer that will hopefully land somewhere. Oh, there's another male right there. Hopefully I can catch one of them. All right, so I found it again. See him chilling out right there. I got it! Woo. Man, it's been a fantastic day. I'll get them out and give you guys a clean look at them. See the dark body, the prunose abdomen, black and white, black on the inside or uh, bottom part of the wings, and white on the outside. Gorgeous dragonfly, absolutely gorgeous. Glad I caught him too. Excellent. So, there's definitely a few more species flying around and hopefully I can catch a couple more and show you guys. Alright so I was chasing a different dragonfly all the way across this field and I managed to catch a different one uh, than the one I was chasing. Um, this one is actually a female widow skimmer. So as you remember I just caught that male. And now, come on. Got a female. You can see the last the prunos abdomen and the white on the wings. It still has that black area though. Uh, yeah. Can't complain that I got a male and female of a species. So that's always nice to have. Uh, so yeah. 
We're going to put this in an envelope and continue on our way. A little water through this spot right here. And there's quite a few damselflies flying around. And actually, quite a few of that in copulation right now. See the male and female right there. I thought that was kind of interesting. I wanted to show you guys. Oh, looks like we... Have a little different species here. Very interesting looking one. Uh, not exactly sure on the species, but kind of cool. Heading back to our uh, first location that we started off the day at. Hoping to get a couple of species, more species. But I did just see something interesting. Oh, uh, never mind. Just more of the same old damsel flies that's been flying around everywhere. Well, found another dragonfly species. See right there, we got an amber wing. It's a small species of skimmer. But Ooh. completely missed that. And luckily it didn't go very far. Good idea. I did. Cool. Uh, so I'm going to come over here. Maybe in the shady part. And get out and show you guys. You can see how small it is. It's an absolutely gorgeous species. Now out here, I don't know if it's a different species of amber wing or it's the, just a eastern amber wing, because um, that's what I'm used to seeing, like back home or back out east. Uh, 
So I'm not entirely sure of the Colorado fauna yet, uh, but I'm definitely getting to get more familiar with it after today. But uh, yeah, nice awesome little find right there. And another species added to the catch today. Alright guys, well, it's past 11 o'clock, it's starting to get pretty hot out, and uh, peak collecting time is pretty much done. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very happy about today, I had very good success, had quite a few species, um, missed quite a few species that I saw here flying, so that's kind of disappointing, but... I can't complain. I got to show you guys some a little more variety this time and hopefully hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, and uh, yeah, so I'll see you guys uh, next time.